My name is Christian LeBlanc, also known as Lost LeBlanc. And my name is Laura Reed. Hello, guys. What a coincidence to run into here. You guys are in Hollywood. How are you? Amazing, yeah. We actually just went upstairs to say hi to Will Dasovich, one of our best friends, and he lives in the Philippines. And uh, we just on the way out got to meet you guys, which is yes. like so coincidental. <laughs> Band go up a little bit, you guys. <laughs> so, you guys are travel bloggers. Um, how did that whole idea start? Uh, you know, it never started off intentionally. Um, I just made videos using my GoPro. I was on a school exchange in Bangkok and I was like, this is pretty cool. I want to remember this when I'm older one day. So I made some really basic videos. They were really shaky. There was no cinematics, no music. And I just cut them together, put them on YouTube. And very slowly but surely, uh, an audience found my channel and it, it built into what it is today. Yeah, we've actually spent about two months in the Philippines, and so we've seen a lot of places. We've been uh, pretty much all throughout Cebu. Uh, we love Palawan. We went to Coron, El Nido, and uh, there's a big trip in store, hopefully once the rain stops in the Philippines. Yeah, it is rainy season. Until it is. like September or something. Yeah, I was going to go pretty much today to the Philippines, but then I looked at the weather and I was like, no, I'm going to Indonesia for now. <laughs> no big deal. Yeah. Philippines, where can I go? Yeah, no, we love that place so much. Like, Everything from the people to the landscapes, it's, it's our favorite in all the travel we've done, so we keep coming back. Other than the Philippines, where um, has been your favorite place to go to? Do you want to take that? I would say probably Indonesia, which is probably why it's coming back. That's us, I would say, our second favorite place to travel to. Um, and Thailand. And Thailand. Yes. Yeah. We spent a lot of time in Thailand. We actually both used to live in Bangkok uh, for three months, about two years ago. He was on an exchange program, and so we got the experience to kind of get someone who actually would live there, and we got to see a cool restaurants and. We love Southeast Asia, so this is yeah, one of my favorite places to go back to. Where would be one place you'd want to go? Uh, well, Dubai's up there because I think it'd be so interesting to see the like not landscapes, but the cityscapes that you can't really see anywhere else in the world. But for just like straight photographic, like you know, bliss, I think I would go to the Maldives. Maldives look so stunning, but I kind of want to save that for a special occasion, like you know, a honeymoon or something like that. But it, it truly is one of my top places to go. Well, I'm kind of digging myself in a hole right now where I keep trying to make it more beautiful and it adds more and more time. My most recent vlogs, which I don't even call vlogs anymore because they're so cinematic, they're more like videos, they now take about 15 hours each. Uh, from voiceover to color grading to just putting together the story. Uh, so yeah, it, it keeps going up and uh, I'm really loving what I'm making right now, so it's worth every minute. Alright, I'm going to put you guys through a random question, random okay. fire round. You guys ready? Yes. <laughs> what are you watching on Netflix? I don't have Netflix and I don't watch any because I'm always on the road. Okay, yeah. I was watching 13 Reasons Why. Ah! Yes. Super emotional. It is. A little too deep for me. I can not watch it. I saw her watching. But it's one of those shows you start watching and you can't stop. You're like, I need to see what happens again. So it, it pulls on. you but it was Will. <laughs> and um, lastly, what do you get on your pizza? Okay, uh, I love meat lovers, just anything with a good carnivore fix. Yeah. And I'm straight cheese. I could have cheese for every meal every day. Any kind of cheese? 
Uh, yes, except blue cheese, cheese, which is a little smelly. <laughs> the nasty blue, the nasty yeah, cheese. Perfect. Yeah. Do you guys have any important travel tips for our viewers? I would say my number one travel tip would be to just go to the place you want to go to with an open mind. I don't like to book things in advance. A lot of the time, especially when you're traveling Southeast Asia, you don't book things in advance because you pay way more when you do. You just buy your ticket, you get there, talk to a local or another traveler and find your way around by doing that. I've always found the most success doing that and it really opens up your eyes to being flexible and seeing, you know, living in the moment. I, f I find that's my number one travel tip. And for me, I would say the biggest question I always get asked is what should I bring traveling? And people are usually scared before they go on the trip. And I always say just make sure you have your essentials, like your passport and your medicine, and everything else you can basically find on the road. So don't worry too much about clothes and just bring the basic amount of stuff you need and you'll be good to go. A message for all your subscribers, all your fans. Um, just follow your passion. I would say that my channel has been about following a passion and it's led me to doing the coolest job in the world. And uh, that will be back in the Philippines very soon. And thank you guys so much for all your support. We love you. Yeah. What's up guys? My name is Christian LeBlanc, also known as Lost LeBlanc. And my name is Laura Reed. I'm Laura Reed with two Ds on Instagram. You can also see my videos on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, pretty much everywhere. It's at Lost LeBlanc. And you can find me at Laura Reed with two Ds. <laughs> that sounded weird. I feel like did that sound weird? A little weird. <laughs> <laughs>